what a great day to sew something wonderful. I'm Kia with Kia B. And this is Tech Guy from The Hive. And we are ecstatic to be back with you today. We get to unbox the sew sampler, which by far I think is my favorite um, subscription box that we have. It's the one that starts it all. Like started it all. Like that was the Do first. you think so? Uh, for us, it did. Yes, for us, for it did. Us. Yes, so I don't know that this was the first quilting box, um, subscription box, but to us for it us, was. it was. Lost. So we have been subscribing to Fat Quarter Show Sew Sampler Box um, since the very beginning. We missed the very first month because we didn't know about it. Um, but now we do, and we've never turned back, and we absolutely love it. This box is $24.95 a month, and you get at least five items in every single box. They can be fabric, notions, patterns, right. um, different things, thread which I know is a notion. And then they also come with a sew along. So this year has been the barn block that will change. I think this is number 11. So in April that will change to a yep. new, a new sew along. Um, and so we're really excited to see what's inside this box. Yeah, I'm pretty sure their fiscal year on the box is like in spring. I think it's April to March, April to March. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. So, and um, we've got some really exciting updates coming for you and Kia B. And one of those, we've done something really super super fun with the barn blocks and um, I'll just say they are not quilted but they are super fun and no I didn't do them no he didn't do them I saw so we'll I, keep I've it as it. a teaser for yes. right now but you're gonna be seeing some new things come up with Kia B and our posting schedule and things that we are doing here in the hive and we've kind of expanded a little bit of our crafting and so yep. we want to share that with you all and I think y'all are really gonna like it so um, we've done something really fun with our bar barn blocks, and I can't wait to show you. Without further ado, though, let's go ahead and get into this box this month and see what we've got inside. Okay, I'm so excited to get this opened up. I think the sew sampler is definitely a great value. It's a classic. It is a classic. Oh, wow. It's I come out. Look at that. That's your favorite part. It this is, is my Tech Guy's favorite, favorite part. It's just so This cool. marketing I know opportunity just, I know right that here. That sounds really, really. No, but I mean Dumb, it's a good but it's, like I, they have a great thing. It pops out. Yeah. Not only and then just this that thing that, right here, like that is that guy's favorite thing. It's my about this favorite box. part of the box. <laughs> okay, so this month's box is Tropical Oasis for February. So that's really exciting. That's cute. A little scissors. I like that. What do you think is gonna be in here? Tropical patterns. Tropical patterns. <laughs> Thanks. Okay, on the back of this, we've got 20% off for Andover fabrics. That's exciting. Um, and so that there's always a coupon that comes on the back of this card. So make sure really you nice. use it because you know you never yes. know when you're gonna make an order and then you forget to use <laughs> yes. the coupon code. That's true. That happens to me all the time. So this is the card that tells us all about what's in the box. I'm not gonna open that yet. We're gonna save that to the end and then we'll um, figure out the value of that. Okay, right on top here. Pineapple quilt block foundation paper used for foundation paper. Paper, paper piecing, fantastic for scraps and pre-cuts. <gasps> oh, look at that! So, what is paper piecing? Okay, so paper piecing is where you literally sew on top of paper, but it you go in order. It depends. There's foundation paper piecing, and then there's like English paper piecing, and some is other kinds. Is this the latest thing? Because I feel like this is coming. No, out of this nowhere. is no, this is not oh, a it's new been thing. Going on for yeah. A while. So then, with this, see how there are numbers: one, two, three, four, five. So with this, you start with one. And you make sure that the placement of fabric, it says, make sure the placement one fabric square is turned on point. So like if it's a directional, you wanna make sure. And then, so you put one and two together and you sew on number two's line. Then you put, you add number three and you sew on that. And it, so it goes all I'm the way around. to the party. Oh my word, that's, that's pretty so, cool. this is cool. So this is made by Fat Quarter Shop. It may, will make a six and a half inch unfinished paper pieced block. And you can make 40. That would make a whole quilt. I'm glad you, you broke that down for me. I mean, that would make a whole quilt. That's, that's awesome. so cool. I would like to see how that, that whole Man, what a great like thing to use for scraps. Because you only have to have pieces that are this big. Oh, like you yeah. like a scrap buster. Yeah. Got it. That's awesome. Okay, so that's exciting. Okay, our next thing is fabric. This is Allison Glass. I know some people were very excited. I saw some buzz on Instagram that um, that it might be some Allison Glass fabric. So I knew that people were very, very excited. So we've got some, look at these colors. Like these are very, very, bright. very bright and radiant. There's some word fabric in here. 
That is very, like ooh, look done. at that. There's like bright, and then there's also like this chalkboard looking. Look at that contrast. It reminds me of like the construction paper books. That's cool. Like the fabric. So we've got two, yeah. So we've got two charm packs of those. That's good. Wow, that is just, I just can't get over the vibrance of those Allison Gloss. This is called Some Print 2019 for Andover. Fitting. Fitting. Very fitting. All right, what else do we have in here? Next, we have Add a Quarter Plus. Okay, so I'm actually going to open this to show you because if I can get it to show on camera the right way. So this, ha do you see how this is, um, oh my goodness. It's like transparent. It's like a ledge. Oh. Like if I put, yes, if I put this card here, like, it stop. I can't even oh. get this on camera. See how it like stops, but that's not the end of the ruler right there. I get it. So it's got this. Yeah, it's called Add a Quarter Plus, and it's supposed to help with this foundation paper paper piecing. So basically, as you're folding it on your paper, because you fold your paper back, you lay this, and it adds that quarter inch seam allowance right there. And How then clever. you're able to cut it. It's a, it's such a good idea. That's awesome. I'm gonna, I may have to reach out to Fat Quarter and ask if I can, I may show this on how to use this. I'm not sure that I have to ask permission for that, but I want to make sure that they don't have a tutorial a coming about, out. Yeah. yeah. I don't want to step on any toes, but they might have a tutorial coming out on how to use that. Watch <laughs> fingers. Okay. So we've got the Add a Quarter Plus. That's really cool. What is this? This looks like a self-defense weapon. Okay, let's see what this is. It's wooden. That's all I can tell right now. It's called Alex, or by Alex Anderson. It's like a, a fat pencil shape. Yikes. I don't know who Alex Anderson is, but that's pretty. Okay, so this is a four-in-one essential sewing tool by CNT Publishing. So, oh, this, oh. oh, my word, look at that. So you've got, so there's one function, I guess. Ooh, I bet you could use this side because see how it's a uh, it's like flat tapered. Yeah. I wonder if you could maybe um, finger press with that. Hmm. That or else, what else could you do with that? I don't know. I bet this side opens too. Oh, I'm scared. Oh, it's a stiletto. So you've got the metal stiletto, and then this is, um, wow. A non-metal. Oh, you know what you could use this for if you were. Um, like stuffing, you know, like bamboo sticks. Do you put the fill, uh, fiber fill in it? He has no idea what I'm talking about, guys. I don't know, but it sounds real cool, though. <laughs> but you can use that for that as <laughs> Comment well. Comment below if you actually so you, have used one because yes, I want to know what you're So you've got one using. tool, two, two tools is the seam ripper. The third tool would so. be this wooden stiletto, and then the metal stiletto is number four. That's, uh, that's pretty handy. That is pretty handy. Now I can't get the cap to go back on. There we go. So would that be something in your uh, in your your tool chest over there that you have with yeah. all your uh, so I have this arms reach. tool caddy. What's it? Stash and store. Stash and store. We got this in a so sampler box. Gosh, yes, a, long a long time ago. ago. And so I just have it's like the silicone. So yeah, absolutely. This would I'm just say with that. This sits right next to my sewing machine yeah. all the time. Like at arms reach. So yeah, you'll see. I have a lot of. I have one of those IKEA three tiered carts, and that sits right oh, in the top of it. Perfect. Yeah. Okay, so then we've got a pattern. This is called Mai Tai. Oh, look at the, it's the pineapple blocks. That's what you do with those. Nice. So this is one, two, three, three by four. So you're using um, 12 blocks in that pattern, right? Three, six, nine, 12. Yep. 12 blocks. Bonus size option included. It's very like a uh, summary yeah. pattern. Like that's yeah, that's cool. in the backyard. and Yeah. And then our barn block recipe. Of and course. like I said, um, teaser, teaser. We have something fun coming up with this. So do you know what I realized this box doesn't have? It doesn't have a finishing kit. That's okay. Wah, wah. That's all right. We really liked how, and I just said on last month's video, I really hope they continue to do the finishing kits. I think that it's part of the feelers, right? I think with yeah. every, uh, not so sampler, but uh, with every subscription box, I think they're wanting the feedback because this is a great outlet to get the feedback from. Yeah. Uh, because it's an instant response rather than someone calling or yeah. someone emailing and things like right. that. And please comment below if you like the box or love it, uh, or there's something you didn't like about it, comment below. And uh, I know there's people watching um, and we enjoy reading the comments too and yeah. uh, things that we didn't think of pop up. So mm -hmm. 
So with this, you just need some background, some binding, and some backing. So I guess in all honesty, like they did really give us everything we need to make the quilt top except for the background. And in a finishing kit, they just give us like extra. So like last month with the finishing kit, y'all, I made the spool quilt and it is adorable. It's so cute. Um, and so with that finishing kit, they gave us like a border and I think the binding maybe. I haven't put the binding, I haven't quilted it yet. So, I mean, really you're getting every, I mean, you're getting the pineapple blocks and the fabric. And you're so tools. Yeah. To and you're getting out. tools to do it too. So it's, I mean, this really is a finishing kit in itself because yeah. you need the turn packs and you need the paper. And I think they kind of really put some thought into it about like the oh, tools yeah. that they, that some people maybe 100% need and they won't know how to start into the paper piecing. Yeah. So that's and it nice. looks like for the center of their pineapple blocks, they use the background. So that's what's giving that. And then every other piece or every other layer is a, is the background. It's like an echo effect. That is so cool, you guys. I really like, it is not my style of quilting at all, but I've wanted to make pineapple blocks and this is gonna be a great cheater way to do that. So that's really cool. Okay, so let's um, run through this super quick because um, I just don't wanna babble, babble, babble all the time. Something else that um, Fat Quarter Shop will do sometimes is members only exclusive savings. So we get a members only coupon this this month for 20% off any of the box items. So if we want more of these, like say we want to make a bigger quilt, we just grab more of these and we get 20% off of them, which is awesome. Okay, so the quilt pattern is $9.98, the $4.98. The um, Sunprint Charm Packs, there are two Charm Packs and the you can uh, they retail on Fat Quarter Shop's website for $19.96. The Pineapple Block, and we are the first time seeing this. We are the first to be able to see this. Um, and so this was $7.98. $7.98 for paper piecing and we get to like make 40 blocks out of that. Okay, so we've got that. That almost does not even fit in the box. That's what popped out. I know. This add a quarter is a six, six inch plus pink ruler. And I think it's pink because some of the proceeds must go to breast cancer awareness. That's what it looks like. Because it does have the breast cancer ribbon right there. And it is retail for $8.98. And then this Alex Anderson's four in one essential sewing tool is $18.98. So that's really cool. The one thing I do wish they still did because they did this on like the first year, maybe even two years of the boxes is they, and I love how they break down like, okay, this is worth $18.98. This is worth $8.98. I wish they would put at the bottom maybe like a whole box value. Yeah. Like the box is valued at, you pay $24.95 and the box is valued at XYZ. But some of the other boxes Because I don't, don't do math do that. really fast. The other boxes don't do that either. That's true. So we just have to run it. Like, but yeah. it would be really cool to say, hey, this is what you're, what's worth inside. Yeah, absolutely. I, I really liked this box a lot. There's not really been a ton of boxes I haven't liked with Fat Quarter Shop. Yeah. It stretches my creativity. Because sometimes it's not fabric that I would use. But the project I would love. Right. So like this fabric, I don't know that I would necessarily pick out for myself. But the the quilt itself, I would 100% make. I think it's just stretching yourself out of that comfort zone. Yeah. For sure. I like it. All right. Thank you so much for joining us in the hive today. What was your favorite thing in the box? We would love to know in the comments down below. Um, what do you think you'll get the most use out of? And um, I would love to know your feedback. We get so much feedback. And I do believe that the people who are curating these boxes read the comments. We say that on a lot of our other unboxing videos during unboxing week. But we've gotten confirmations that they are watching yes, the boxes. Well, yes, they actually have like reached out and said thank you for doing these right. or whatever. And like some of the boxes we partner with, like Quilty Box, and so they actually do read the comments. Right. And so comment down below, are there things that you would change? Are there things that you absolutely love and you know they're putting so much hard work into these boxes? Let us know in the comments down below. And I mean, these curators are watching these comments on all of these absolutely. unboxing videos. So share your opinion. I mean, we love to continue the conversation. Yep. So thank you so much again for joining us in the Hive today and y'all have a great day.